Single speed is all I need. Keep it single speed. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 Good morning world Today's video brought to you by Bike Blogger So today I want to talk about waking up in the morning As usual I'm gonna have some tips in the video description below we're gonna run them off here pretty quickly just briefly let's see I want to make a left up here do something slightly different probably get stopped by the stoplight too okay not going that way it's too too busy hang on a second I'll show you that yeah it's like a trash truck or something over there I could po possibly take the uh, sidewalk but I'm not gonna so we're gonna make a right at this street instead so how do you wake up in the morning believe it or not bike blogger is not I'm talking to myself in third person here I am NOT a morning person so, how do I wake up? Outside of, of course, riding my bike and waking up. How do I motivate myself? Or how do I just get ready in the morning? Well, I recommend eating something before you go. Ah, geez, the light just went green. Whew. Oh yeah, made it through. I was gonna stop and talk a little, but the light went green, lucky me, I guess. So, you wanna eat something, I recommend taking a shower, wake yourself up, clean yourself off. I guess you're doing work up here too. and uh, go to bed early. I know all this stuff sounds easy, but it's not, not for me. What's going on back here? Okay, lots of stuff going on today. Uh, gonna drop down the curb here, it's a pretty steep curb. Ah, hopefully I didn't just mess up my tire. I got a road bike here. Um, yeah, so go to bed early. Uh, eat something. Take a shower. What else? Plan your route out ahead of time. Figure out which way you're going to go. So you don't have to worry about all this stuff when you wake up in the morning. Uh... Do a test ride, you know, maybe on an easier day, like a Sunday afternoon or something. Um, what else? Uh, lay out your clothes ahead of time. So, you know, you know, you don't have to think about what to wear. You're all set to go. Just pick them up, put them on, and go. You know, it's all about, you know, making it easier for you. The viewer, the bike commuter, you know, just have all that figured out. Inspect your bike the night before so you don't really have to mess with all that in the morning. If you ride a mount, uh, mountain bike, if you ride a road bike though, you'll always want to pump up the tires before you leave anyway though. But uh, yeah, you can inspect your bike the night before and not have to, not have to think about it. Um, what else? Figure out how you're gonna carry things. I got a video on that. There's like 10 different ways you can carry stuff. Popular way is a backpack. Uh, another popular way for commuters or panniers 
um, which are bags you attach to your bicycle, which really makes a lot of sense if you got a lot of stuff to carry or you're like taking a change of clothes with you every day. Take your lunch with you. Um, all right, these people parked, pointing the wrong way on the street and stuff. Let's see what else we got. Uh, pull up my list here. It's quiet back here. Whew. Yeah, so it's a Tuesday. Eat something, shower. Good morning, world. Uh, lay out clothes. Check your bike before. Ride with a friend or a coworker if you can. Crap. Ah. Don't ride your bike while you're looking at your phone, maybe too. <laughs> yeah, you know, maybe see if you can get a see if you can get a coworker a little interested in riding to work, especially if you live near each other. There we go. Oh, uh, you know, it could be more motivating for some people, especially enough. You know, like, you know, you, you got someone waiting for you, you know, to go ride with. They're counting on you, you know, it can sort of pressure you a little more. Not that I'm saying pressure is a good thing exactly, but you know, it can get you going, get you a little motivated. Because I am not a morning person myself. I don't have anyone who lives right near around me that I can ride to work with. Big trucks. Slow it down. What's he doing? Is he backing up? Nope. What's he doing? I don't know, he just sort of stopped back there now. Okay. It's a busy day today. It's a really nice day. High at 85 degrees Fahrenheit, so right now it's probably like, I don't know, 78, 75 degrees Fahrenheit. Pretty darn nice right now. It's sunny, partly cloudy, yada yada yada. Nice weather today. What else we got? Uh, I think that just about covers it except for a couple other things. You want to figure out where you're going to lock your bike when you get to work and how you're going to lock it. You know, these sort of things. Left. Um, so you know you'll want to figure that out. See if you can take your bike inside. That's really the best option. See if there are any bike racks near your work. Otherwise, it's pretty simple. You just lock it to a a pole in the ground, like a no parking pole. <laughs> um, make sure the poles really in the ground though it can't be easily lifted out problem with doing using that like a a, par, uh, a sign of some sort is you know <clears throat> if a thief really wants your bike they could remove the sign at the top of the pole and then just pull it up and over so that's why you don't really want to do that um i'm gonna go left here <sighs> single speed is all i need Keep it single speed. All right. Whew. 23 miles an hour. What's going on up here? Now this guy's backing up in the street. What the heck? It's getting into the parking lot, it looks like. Goofy stuff. Goofy stuff. Okay. Whew. Uh, one of the last things, have some emergency items with you. Bandages, water, <laughs> uh, spare flashlight. Always good to have special extra lights. You want to have lights anyway on your bike. But you know, again, just another reason 
another way to not have an excuse to go ride. And indeed, if you got the money, have a spare bicycle in case uh, something ends up happening to yours. Hopefully it doesn't get stolen, but if it, uh, oh, not comfortable road at all here. If it, uh, you know, I need some repair or something, and you can't get it fixed right away, uh, you can at least grab your backup bike. Oh, man. Okay. All right. Woo! Now we're on some smooth road. What I like to do after doing something like that is pulling off to the side and stopping, which is what we're going to do here real quick. Just make sure my tires and everything are okay. All right. Go this way now. Sneak, sneak back behind here and go to the water fountain today. Smooth sailing right now. Playing, paying close attention to all the parked cars, making sure nobody's in them so they don't back up on me and keeping a safe distance. So yeah, let's see if I can remember what I just said. Eat something, go to bed early. Uh, what else? Um, Oh man, eat something, go to bed early. There's a water fountain. Drink some water, take a shower. Lay out all your clothes ahead of time. Check your bike ahead of time, you know, the night before. So you don't have to deal with that. I don't go this way today. Do, 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 do. It's like I'm going to work, but I don't work over here. Uh, okay, let's we'll go this way. Bunch of businesses lease property over here. Ah, oh, shoot, I can't get out over here, can I? I don't think so. We're gonna make a... Let's see, oh, I can get out over here. All right, safe. Make a right. And go up this way. Do, 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 do. Cross the bridge. Nobody around. We're gonna go back up this way now. Going in circles. I get on this road for a brief second as we're on our way to work here. I got a yield sign, so I'm gonna have to sort of slow down, unfortunately. All the sign, the light's red anyway. No one behind me though. We're gonna make a right here. up this way truck good morning world let's make a left so what works for me eh, my commute's short so I drink water beforehand but I don't really eat anything very much grab something to eat when I get to work um, after my little workout and uh, take a shower you know that wakes me up um, and just have stuff ready to go you know check the weather the night before you know know, wh know where you're gonna go like I said plan out your route ahead of time so you just have less stuff to think about again more in the description below um, so yeah, it's all good. Waking up in the morning. Make a left here. And stop.
wave some people on and be on our way to work. All right. Good deal. See you next time. See, there's a bunch of bikes over here. Uh, how do I get out of here? Let's see. I think I need to go sort of around.